In today's video, we're going to learn how collision detection works in Pygame. It's one of the easiest tools to use for this kind of thing, and it's going to enable you to make amazing games. So let's go to it and come to a crash. So in this first bit, we're going to set up a Pygame. Please make sure you've imported Pygame. If you're using MU, the good news is it's already been set up for you. So that's one of the advantages of using MU. Um, going to initialize it we're going to display the window title and we're going to set the size of that notice that we're calling this window window so the next thing we're going to do is draw something once and in this case we're going to draw a rectangle we're going to call that rectangle rect place and so we're going to use the draw rectangle function and go through the window the colors and the positioning Next, we ask the window to update and this puts the rectangle on. Now we're going to move on to the main loop, the gaming loop, and just a simple while running. So while the program is running, it's going to do that. Pos equals pi game, and it's going to get the position of the mouse, and it's going to check if the two actually work. And this is built in functionality into uh, pi game, so that's really nice. And if it does happen, it says, don't touch me. And then finally, we allow the quit option in Pygame, which is fairly standard code. And so there you have it. You now know how to collide into a rectangle. Perfect. If you enjoyed this, please do sub to the channel and let me know if you want any more of these kind of tutorials or if there's anything in particular in Pygame you think would be fun to play with. It's a really nice little tool for 2D games. If you're going 3D, I'll be honest, you're probably better off with uh, Unity or Unreal. But for 2D, it's amazing what fun things you can do, not just games, all sorts of things that require quick drawing and exciting graphics.